What is going on everybody? Today, we're going to be going over Toxapex and how you can use it in the Terror Raids. And honestly, it's a very good mix supporter depending on what you're going against. So, let's jump into it. So, Toxapex is actually a very bulky Pokemon being a poison water type. Your Terror type on mine is a poison. You can have water. It just depends on what you kind of want to deal with. Now, the held item that I run on mine is Poison Barb. What this is, is an item held by a Pokemon that the small poisonous bar boosts the power of the poison type moves. So if you are running poison type moves, you can actually do even more damage with the poison. Hence why I'm running a poison Terra type here to help me get more poison damage off. Now let's jump into the moves to see kind of what we're working with here. So for our moves, we are running Chilling Water, Acid Spray, Sludge Bomb, and Recover. Chilling Water is going to be the first move we cover here, and it's obviously we've ran it on things before. It's really, really good. And honestly, if you go in and it's a physical attacker, you can just go ahead, click Chilling Water, lower its attack stat, and you're done. It's perfect. You just make them do less damage, and it helps out your team. Now our next move is going to be Acid Spray. This is going to be a damaging move that lowers the special defense stat of the opposing Pokemon. Now keep in mind, Acid Spray, very good, helps you do more damage because you are attacking on that special side, but you are a poison type, so you get a stab onto that. Plus, Poison Barb, since we are running that, it boosts the damage even further. So, just dropping the special defense on the Pokemon, you're already going to be doing quite a bit of damage. Now, our last move, which is going to be our main attacking move, is going to be Sludge Bomb. What this does is it hurls Sludge, I mean, it's in the name Sludge Bomb, and it's a 90 base power poison move, which can also poison the target. I mean, you're going to be putting on a status. You're going to be getting a boost because you're going to be dropping the special defense of the Pokemon plus poison type plus Terra type that's poison plus your poison barb. You're going to be doing a lot of damage if you are actually running a good setup here and getting something pretty good off. I and mean, if you are running against stuff that is resistant to poison, Obviously, I'd probably use a different Pokemon, but this is still very solid. And then your last move actually won't do damage. It's going to be Recover to help you recover your HP if you do get low. Because sometimes you do just sit there and get hit, get hit, get hit, and get crits. So you can just heal up. Now let's jump over to our spread. Kind of see what we're looking at there because it is a little bit tricky for that spread. So for our spread, we are going to be running a 252 HP a 128 special attack, a 60 special defense, and a 60 defense. All that, very, very good. You become very bulky. And with your typing, it's very interesting that you do become such a bulky Pokemon. Now your ability is going to be merciless. There are others, this is kind of just what I run. Pokemon's attacks become critical hits if the target is poisoned. So, Sludge Bomb can poison the target. And honestly, there you go. Bam. Starting to land critical hits if you do get that poisoned. Based off of everything else, you can do more damage because of poison bar of your terror type and everything like that. So, very good ability if you are kind of leaning in to just straight poison damage. Getting on to our standard stats here, we're going to be running a 304 HP, which is a little on the low end, but still a solid HP stat. Now, defense, a 390 defense stat. That is very good. We only have 60 invested into that so that's really really high plus we have the mint our mint is going to be a bold mint so it's going to be lowering the attack and upping your defense stat speed is a 106 keep in mind everything here is bottle capped at level 100 except for attack because well attack you're not going to be using then our special defense stat which is also a 60 investment is a 335 so i mean 300 304 at 335 and a 390 on your HP and defenses, <laughs> you're going to be taking a lot of hits and then throwing on recover. Yeah, <laughs> you're going to be a wall. And your special attack is a 176. Do we want to see that a little higher? We only have 128 invested. So, I mean, it is okay, but you are going to be pretty much being a support, leaning into the poison to do more damage and then doing the acid sprays to help you out. So, a very solid support set. Now within the terror raid, you can see that we get in here with the 
Toxapex, and we can do quite a bit. We have variable options, and we are a very good support mod. So, if you are using this online, honestly, you can just keep your team alive and help your team do a lot of damage in the meantime. Because with Chilling Water, you can drop the attack stat, Sludge, Acid Spray, you can go ahead and drop that special defense stat. And then go ahead and just fire off sludge bombs. And then whenever the team needs you, just heal cheer or just sludge bomb your way to the end. So another very, very good support mon. And honestly, I'd kind of put him in the hybrid move set here. So very good as well. Now this is my Toxapex set. It is very good. I would keep in mind that you can run Rain Dance. You can run Venom Shock, Venom Shock kind of guarantees you a poison status and then rain dance helps you get less damage from fire types if you are with grass types so that does keep in mind and it does boost your chilling water so just keep that in mind now if you did find this helpful and you do like tox effects being a support mon go ahead drop a like subscribe and i'll catch you on the next array build